It's a new and improved truck made specifically for Long Island brush fires. So far, more than 100 firefighters have taken this tough training course in the Pine Barrens and Ridge, squeezing through trees and negotiating narrow turns. As you can see by the, the tires, uh, there's a lot of mud in here. This is a bumpy ride. Even crouching down, there's mud, there's branches and other debris flying at you. During a brush fire, you can add heat, smoke, embers, and ash. Firefighters say it can get intense. The smoke could be blinding, the smoke could be gagging, and they how close you are to the fire. Today, these firefighters from Patchogue practiced hosing from the truck. In a real wildfire, they need to decide whether to spray from the burnt section of the woods, known as the black, or from the unburnt section, known as the green. If there's not a lot of wind, they might attack the blaze from the green. But if the wind's kicking up, the fire's coming at you, you're in the fuel when you're in the green, and you could, you know, possibly lose your life, your crew, and, and your truck. This truck was rebuilt after the catastrophic West Hampton brush fire back in 1995. 7,000 acres burned. At this time, just two years ago, a wildfire destroyed another 1,000 acres and forced evacuations in Suffolk. Willie Cerrone of the New York Wildfire Academy designed this course with that damage in mind. What we did is we looked at the fuels that are on Long Island, the, the trees, the topography. We also looked at the fire behavior. And with peak brush fire season now here, the extra training couldn't be more timely. In Ridge, I'm Jessica Borg, News 12, Long Island. There will be another training course for firefighters across Long Island.